Okay, Randy, let's let's start with the rules. Yeah, let's start well, with your top five. The thing you need to think about is how do you want to look on your wedding day? Do you want to be bohemian? Do you want to be romantic? Do you want to be sexy? Do you want to be blinged out? What kind of bride are you? Traditional, maybe you're trendy. And then you need to think about the silhouette. Do you want like a sexy mermaid or an A-line or fit to flare? Okay. But it sounds like you kind of she's have an on, idea already. Yeah. So she's, she's got more of a vintage, you know, or a, a lacy, lacy kind of romantic. So the romantic. Yeah. She likes her back, open back. You know, they're CrossFit yeah. trainers. So yeah. <laughs> she's got all this business, six packs, 12 packs. I don't, I, so if you, so if you, I ain't got them, so I don't know. So if you have an open back, what you have to keep in mind is you have to have something on the shoulder. Otherwise, if you go with a low back and it's strapless, it's not going to be able to stay up. Right. Right. Yeah. Well, you don't want to show too much business on your no, wedding days. No. Some of them Even though. Right, so let me tell you. <laughs> Although last night I bet they had a lot of fun with them eye goggles, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, daytime show. We'll edit that out. We'll edit that out. Okay. Oh. So we've got two out of the. So we've got a, a two two checks on the list. She wants lace. She wants an open back. Maybe next. Yeah. And um, what kind of silhouette are you thinking? Full on the bottom, you said, but fitted, right, through very here. fitted through the torso. Mm -hmm. um, kind of have the big butt going on, so maybe not so much there. Just maybe not there. Hips, you do not then. have a big butt. <laughs> I have a big butt. You, you do not have a big butt. But, but show you want us. Want to fuller on the bottom? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? The thing about wedding dresses is no matter, you know, what your body type is, there is a dress that will fit your body type, and we will find that dress. So if you're a little fuller here, what you want to do is maybe go for a fit to flare that kind of hides that and camouflages that. And that's what that. she was kind of yes. vibing. So exactly. it sounds yeah. like you two are kind of on the same page. Yeah. Definitely. So come on okay. over with me, Let's Brittany, and tell me if you see anything that you like. Now, this is on the shoulder, so it has a little V back, okay. a low back, I don't know. This is gonna be a nice I fit like to flare on you. Okay. And it's a corset back, so that's gonna hit you right in the right spot okay. if you're open to strapless. It yeah. doesn't have your low back, and it's not really that vintage-y look. Okay. We have this that's vintage, high at the top. It has a Gorgeous. sheer back, but it's not a low back. Okay. I don't know that we have a low, low back here. But and we can always okay. get one. Right. And this one is really sexy. Ooh. Now it's a little vintage with the yeah. lace, but it's very kind of modern in the okay. silhouette, and it's very sexy. Okay. So I'd be willing to try it. Okay. So Why which not? ones kind of stand out to you? Um. And I will pull the ones that you like. Well, there's go ahead. really good ones over here too that we like. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> which one do you like, Rachel? <laughs> really? <laughs> we like that one in the back. Oh, there. I didn't even see that this one? yet. Oh, that. Oh, no, that. Oh, love. On the mannequin. It doesn't have love an open it. back, I don't think, but it's hot. Let yes, me take it a look. Is. And it's oh, it's it's open. Oh, oh that's probably please a try little that. Please, 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 that's please try that. That's exactly please. what I. Yeah. That's what you want? Yeah. Okay. Now let me just tell you a little about about sizing and bridal. All right. Bridal is different from ready to wear. Girls say, you know, I'm a four six or whatever, but in bridal, you're going to be probably like an 8 to 10. Are okay. they stupid or what? They yes. should make it... <laughs> yes, they It are. should go the other way. You know that there's those stores you shop in where you're two sizes smaller than you are every place else, and you like going there, right? Well, let me tell you... So you would, wouldn't you think that these bridal people would get hip to that? I told my old boss years ago when I designed bridal, you need to change this because here's what happened is they did, they came up with this during the war, the, the sizes for uniforms, for, you know, the uniforms for right, the right, war. Right, right, right. But bridal never changed, but ready to wear changed with the women as they changed throughout history. So I'm gonna take a quick okay. measurement here of you and just see where we're going. Okay. And what you do is you measure the bust, waist, and hips. And whatever is the biggest on the size chart is the size you go with. And then you take everything in from there. Oh, so, so I don't see. listen to the size ladies. <laughs> don't worry about what size they put you in. If they put you in a 14, don't worry because they're going to take in the rest of the parts. And it's not about size, it's about the silhouette and proportion.